another vlog my name is Ella Craig in case you're new here if you're an old subscriber thank you for always always coming back to watch our videos I'll be making Chelsea's hair today but I'm not making it myself I'm tired of 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 because that's the only hair stuff I know how to make but anyways I'll be having someone come make her hair or we'll go meet the person either way and also we'll be getting clothes for the girls so I'm having someone come over with the clothes just want to bring you guys along on whatever is going to be happening today so please stay tuned like this video and please subscribe in case you find our content interesting we are all about family lifestyle and everything in between basically so yeah <laughs> Hey guys, so this is me showing you how I was able to get rid of Elsie's cradle cap. This is the second time I'm doing this, but the first time I, did I say I messed up? Yes, yeah, so it actually um, cut a whole lot of hair from her. But this second time I'm doing it better because I got to research and I learned a better way of doing it. So right now this is me gently scraping it but you want to ensure that the hair is washed and moisturized first of all then apply enough coconut oil like enough massage it in and allow it for some time once the coconut oil has settled in then you can take a comb and start gradually because this is a baby's scalp so you want to take it gradually please ignore the fact that it's red it's actually okay she's not in any kind of pain it's just the pressure that was being applied to the hair but that is not that intense before now her hair was better but after the first time i made a mistake it now looked like she has bald hair but yeah so make sure the hair is damp before applying the coconut oil allow it to settle in nicely massage it in after some time you can go ahead and start combing and ever since i did this method the cradle cap has not returned but the first time i did it it returned so that's why i'm doing it for the second time now so yeah
the clothes i got for mama leave me for chelsea the other day just leave me alone now so this set i got for i think this one is about 2k and there's this one they are really nice there is this one this beautiful skirt there's another skirt few tops as well I didn't really get for Elsie because what is for Chelsea is for Elsie. <laughs> and there's this top, have the singlet. There's a horse. This one as well. This one, a sweater. I love what this one says chilling with my mama got this beautiful jumpsuit as well so everything costs about how much again okay 21,000 naira mama as in the hills see Elsie's moving in she's different age Red. 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 Green. And uh, I thought it was green. Oh, 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 Hey guys, Morris was able to pick up a uh, Google Pay. We're so excited to be able to receive this. I actually requested for this three times, and the third time I requested, sorry, three times, yeah. So the fourth time I was going to request is going to expire like two days before they demonetize us. I was not bothered anyway because I remember um, Zaram posted. A way to verify manually sometimes so I was like okay when I requested I was expecting to go to the office to Naipo's office and pick it up and I didn't know they were going to come to the house so I had someone that connected me to someone in night post and I called the guy he was like he had delivered it to the house already so making it two I'm not sure where that other one is I guess I've thrown it away because I already imputed the pin and we verified already so yeah, we're super happy. Our account is now being verified. It's frustrating when you don't get your pin, but we're so happy that we're able to get it. Right now, we are eating. Let me get my food. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Catch us on this same channel. See you on our next video. Mama, come say bye. Say bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs>